I would describe my writing life before 12 by 12 as absolutely isolating. No one around me knew I was writing and I had no one to talk to about my writing goals. As a member of 12 by 12, I feel like I have access to the most amazing brain trust. For my burning writing question is, or my illustration question is, I can go to the forums, I can go to the Facebook page, and someone will answer it, and they'll be excited to answer it. The 12 by 12 webinar featuring Aisha Perez Prado struck such a deep chord in me. I literally have thought about it every day since. And in that moment, I felt so seen. English is my second language. And as an ESL student, I internalized a lot of negative stereotypes that were placed on me and my parents and my family. And actually in fifth grade, a school guidance counselor told me that I'd never be as good at English as I am in math because English is my second language. And that was very devastating to someone who loved to read and write. But in this webinar, when Aisha was talking about the history and the internalization of a lot of these experiences, I remember I wrote this down and I have it by my desk. I'm giving power to the rule makers and power holders. And that was just my MO growing up. I was a rule follower. And in that moment, I found permission to not follow the rules and also to accept myself the way I am and also feel like I belonged doing this work. My debut picture book, Moon's Ramadan, benefited greatly from what I call the 12 by 12 brain trust. When it was in the draft stage, I actually had posted it in the forums and gotten feedback from the community. And when I was really ready to get it to that next level of polish, I learned about Marcy Colleen's critique group through the 12 by 12 members. And I joined that and that just really took my work to the next level. And I was able to get an agent with that manuscript that I moved through the 12 by 12 process. And when my agent and I were about to go out on submission, I didn't have an illustrator critique group. So I'm an illustrator as well. And I really just wanted someone's trusted eyes on that. And I very quickly posted something on 12 by 12 and asked, would anyone be able to look at it? And with incredible enthusiasm, lots of people wanted to give feedback. And one amazing illustrator, Sandra Salisbury, actually had a bunch of email exchanges with me, helped me get my submission ready. And then I was able to get a two book deal with Versify, Harper Collins, and 12 by 12 was a part of every step up until that moment. And it continues to be a part of this book's journey. Even in the marketing stages, I knew I wanted to join a marketing group. And lo and behold, someone was forming one for 2023 on 12 by 12. So my entire marketing group of 16 authors and illustrators are 12 by 12 members, (laughs) which is so cool. And even now when I have these small questions like, For my pre-order, I wrote an original song and I was like, who would be able to help me with this obscure piece of information about copyright? I went to the community and Tara Trudell, who is a songwriter and also an author, took the time to listen to my music, make sure that there was no copyright issues. And I'm just like, who does this? Who does this? 12 by 12 members do this. And I just hope I can give back as much as I've gotten. (laughs) 